Tyler Adams, <clears throat> DFB Cup winning player. You join me here. First, we have to talk about the photographer who was being reanimated mm -hmm. just before the trophy lift. What yeah. was going through your head? You saw the tremendous act of humanity from the crowd with their phone lights. Yeah. Just tell us how it was for you. It, it's a, a quick reality check. You realize things. there's a lot of things that are more important than football. And to see how quick everybody reacted, to see uh, how, the, how the safety measures uh, and precautions were taken and how they you know, literally brought him back to life um, was amazing. We're happy to hear that he's stable now um, and then moving towards better conditions. But it just, again, you, you, you win something like this and you, you know, quickly your mind changes and just you pray for someone like that and hope that they're okay because it's a, it's a sad, sad thing. So uh, I'm really happy with how quick everybody realized that. And, you know, obviously the fans did something special. We go to the other side of the coin for yeah, you. The yeah. fact that you won this game yeah. today. How? I guess because when we look back, when you got a man sent off, yeah. you're on the bench. Yeah. You must have been scratching your head, thinking it's happening again. Yeah, it was. You know, obviously a lot of things run through your head. Um, you know, but at that time I couldn't really think about you know the what ifs. It was more of what can I do and, and what can the team do to, to help contribute. And you saw us make a couple substitutions, and the guys that came on, you know, made a huge difference for us. The energy that brought into the game, the fans kept supporting us and cheering us on, and. Um, that's what we needed in that game. You know, it was our third time being in this final, and um, this was a special group today that, that made things happen, and you know, we're really happy to come away with the victory. So what's it like to win it then? Honestly, it's indescribable. It's, it's everything for me. You know, uh, we talk a lot about what it takes to win and um, our team and what we've been through and, and how we're going to show development and growth from the, the amount of times that we've lost in big games. And, um, tonight was that, that growth moment, I think, and you saw it from the guys. We went down a, a man and nobody put their heads down. Instead, we just kept grinding away and, you know, we got it, we got it. Personally, in your young career, yeah. what, what does this mean? Hopefully it's the first of many. You know, you work your whole, your whole life to enjoy this small moment and just get a glimpse of what it feels like. And, you know, now I, you got to keep working and you got to go back in, onto the pitch and work on more things and, and just come in every day with the right mentality and so you can have this feeling again and you know it took me three years to chase this moment and two finals to to get to this moment and um every time you feel you're so close maybe you don't get it but we finally got one today so i'm gonna enjoy it right now but you know tomorrow the the page turns and you just got to keep working towards the next season and, and what's to come when it comes to the next season yeah do you think you'll still be wearing an rb leipzig shirt yeah we'll we'll see what the future holds i'm under contract here uh, obviously a really special moment to be part of history with this team. I've been a part of a lot of historic moments with the team, whether it's Champions League, Pokal, etc. But um, we'll see what the future holds. Playing regular football, though, is very important for you, I guess. Important. 100% important. For my growth as a young player, um, you know, you want to be a part of the biggest moments. You want to continue to grow your game, you know, not only as a person, but as a player, of course. So um, that's important with me, especially with the World Cup coming up. So, yeah, like I said, we'll see what the future holds. Well, thank you very much for watching ESPN on YouTube. For more sports highlights and analysis, be sure to download the ESPN app. And for live streaming, premium content, and let's not forget as well, ESPN FC, seven days a week. Subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.